you guys welcome back to my channel and today's video is actually gonna be kind of different a little just because I'm gonna be showing you guys different stuff that I created for my birthday I wanted to have like a random birthday party um because it's my 24th birthday which is a random number it's not even my 21 or 25th it's 24 so that's really random but um I don't know I just decided to have a birthday this year and a birthday party this year so it's nothing big it's just like food and my friends coming from church and stuff so I wanted to go for like a bohemian vibe I don't know I was really I like bohemian stuff so I decided to make my own floral crown and like decorations for my birthday so um, I'll be showing you guys how to do your own floral crowns and how to do like the table runner garland like a flower garland for the center and maybe little stuff that I got for my birthday but I mean it's not hard it's all really hot glued and a bunch of flowers from Dollar Tree give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoy it and if you guys are excited to watch it and also um, I do have a second channel and if you're interested in watching more of like what happened during my birthday party just go over to my second channel I also try to put a link down below so you guys can watch it or like put it here so you guys can watch that as well um, so yeah let's just get started Okay, so to start off with, I got a bunch of flowers from the Dollar Tree. Everything I got from the Dollar Tree, even the um, leaf garland. All I did was take out the flowers from like the stem or whatever. You just pull them out and they come off easily. And I did the same thing with the leaves. They, come, they just slide out and then I just throw away the stick. So I did that to a bunch of flowers. I did them to all. So after you do that, I suggest doing that in the beginning. Just take them all off in the beginning. I got different ones. I got pink ones, blue ones, white ones, and just any flowers you really like. And I, I kept the leaves. Don't throw those away. So with the leaf um, garland, what I did, I used two to make it thicker. So I Because one of them on its own was short. It, I think it's only like four feet or something like that. And it was really thin and like bald looking. So I paired them up by twos and I paired three the long way. Um, what I did is I just used a safety pin to like connect them both. But that's basically how I did it just to make it fuller all you're gonna need is a hot glue gun and the hot glue sticks and that's basically it you're just gonna be hot gluing the flowers and the extra leaves um, to the garland and that's just gonna make it fuller and look a lot prettier So next, I'm going to do my own table runner. Table runner, I think that's what it's called. And I got the supplies at Michael's. I just bought the material there. I bought two rolls. I got one roll of white lace. And then I got two rolls of this, um, what is this called again? I forget what this material is called. But all I did was get those two rolls and roll it all the way. And I put the lace in the middle and I hot glued it all the way. It took a while, but I mean... It, it's doable and you could ask for help for someone to hold it for you as you glue it along But I mean I did it on my own towards the end my boyfriend helped me So this is how it's going to look I laid it down in my living room just to get an idea of how it's gonna look like and I was really liking it So this is how it ended up looking on the actual day. I used those um wooden Pallets and I layered them on top. I used two and then three the long way and that's basically what I used as a table for the day of my birthday moving on to the flower crowns it was really easy um everything was from the Dollar Tree as well all I used were these little um what are they called again those little sticks glittery ones um so anyways, um, I used those and all I did was did the same thing with the flowers except that this time I made them go through. Um, if you insert it from that little hole right there, it goes all the way through to the other side and all you do is pull them out. You can also hot glue it or tie them somehow but I thought that was the easiest way just pulling them through and then I hot glued some of them after i kind of had an idea of what i wanted just to make them a little bit thicker because i didn't want them too thin and that's basically what you do to all of them and i created like five of them i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys next time bye <laughs>